All right. So this gentleman has been leaving mad comments on my videos, and good for him, okay? Good for him, because uh, he seems to genuinely uh, just want to know the truth, just want to understand. Okay, so let's have some understanding. Um, is it something... The, the subject is uh, specifically priestly vestments, but let's just talk about anything uh, that would fit this criteria. If something is not supported by a biblical example, is it something that has to be done? Uh, by and large, I guess it depends on what the thing is, but with something like priestly vestments, no, it doesn't have to be done. Um, that's a later development. He, uh, he mentioned in a different comment uh, that uh, if there's no biblical example, then how can you say the early church did it? We're not saying that. Uh, it's the other side saying the early church didn't do this. The early church being the first century apostolic church, the apostles, didn't do this. So you can't do it. Well, that's just not true. Okay. Um, it's a development. It developed later. Obviously, the apostles were poor men. They didn't have money to buy nice clothes and dress in uh, priestly vestments like the Pharisees or the Sadducees or uh, or the, the the Old Testament magisterium of the time. Okay, and and they probably didn't have a desire to because they had more important things to do, like spreading the gospel. But no, it doesn't have to be done. No. Uh, your preacher is not necessarily wrong for wearing a suit and a tie instead of priestly vestments. Uh, the Lutherans wear priestly vestments. Uh, that's something that they, they kept from, from the Catholic Church. Uh, the Methodists, I believe, wear priestly vestments. Uh, some churches do, some churches don't. As far as the Catholic Church goes, um... It's a requirement now, but it wasn't always, and it doesn't always have to be in perpetuity. The same thing with the Latin Mass. Uh, the Latin Mass wasn't the the uh, the early church didn't give Mass in Latin; they gave Mass in Greek. Um, the Latin Mass came later, and then the Latin Mass, you know, developed into the vernacular Mass, and uh, and it's just as wrong of radical traditionists to say it has to be the the Latin mass, as it would be to say, priests always have to wear vestments. It could change. 